instinct. It just took over. Bruce Mealing was at Bayside Burger and Beer Wednesday night, sitting outside when he noticed someone running across the street. A switch went off in my head and, and being a, a retired cop, it just, I just knew I had to, you know, help Mount do something. Bruce and a Cape Coral police detective tried calming the person down before this happened. He looked up and looked at the detective, put his back to me. So I, when I had his back, I, I put a bear hug around him. The next thing I know, we're on the ground rolling. Bruce had no idea the person he helped tackle was a robbery suspect, 19-year-old Matthew Brian Sorge. But the robbery didn't happen today or yesterday. It happened on Sunday afternoon at this Publix on Del Prado, where police say Sorge tried to steal deodorant. When an employee stopped him, and the suspect lifted up the hoodie he was wearing, revealed a knife, and threatened that employee. Sorge took off, and police started looking at surveillance video. The suspect came in wearing like a tan colored hoodie and jeans. They said he went into the public's bathroom, changed clothes, then robbed the store. On March 11th, the next day, police got a call from the school resource officer at North Nicholas High School. They said a student overheard Sorge talking about the robbery. Students were talking about how the suspect was wearing the same shoes as the person that was in that still image of, of the robbery. And two days later, March 13th, detectives and the suspect agreed to talk at a store. They say while they were talking to him, he took off. During the time he was running, he actually admitted to the robbery and said he was on drugs at the time of the robbery. And that's when he ran to Bayside, where Bruce was. Good Samaritans were a big help in being able to get this person into custody. It's something Bruce, a retired New Jersey cop, said he didn't expect, but also said he would do it again. Oh, in a heartbeat, in a heartbeat, without a doubt. I don't regret it at all.